what are you coming up with? So this is, uh, I guess, a battle of the upper class and the underground class. Oh. We've got the idea of a big drilling mech popping up, burrowed through the ground, and they're, you know, in that, in that battle. You've got the action, tick, done, but it's just about making it super crystal clear why this thing is up there and why it's happening. OK, well, we might need to... The inspiration that. comes from, you know, uh, many places. So a little bit Bioshock, a little bit Avatar, a little bit of class warfare that would come out of cyberpunk, but it doesn't have to be cyberpunk, you know. They, they, you draw from all those sources and all of a sudden you get something new. But why is it in the sky? That's the question I'm, I'm, I'm wanting to answer. Yep. Brickman might have just given us the first bad advice he's ever given us. Why are they there? Why is it floating in space? I think it's very important, though, that we don't... Like, how does it live on the moment we step away? It's not because we've answered why, it's because they've asked why and continue to ask why. So, like, what happens next? What's just happened? Why? So we don't have to too expressly solve that. Because it comes back to seven uh, beat acts as outlined by Homer, you know? It comes back to that. I, don't, I didn't quite understand what you just said.